Hi guys, Josh back here again. Um, I'm going to go over my tactical setup here. Uh, I don't know if there's many videos on YouTube about this or anything. So, um, anyways, uh, what I have here is basically my tactical gear setup. Um, I've been working on this and kind of moving and improving it a little bit. And I'll go through everything and kind of go over it a little bit quick so it's not too long of a video. Um, what I have here first is my tactical vest. Uh, this is a first choice armor uh, tactical molly vest. Um, I picked this up on eBay. Actually, a lot of this stuff was picked up on eBay. Um, actually, pretty good quality stuff if you just know what you're looking for. Um, relatively inexpensive as well. Um, on the vest, I have mounted at the top here a generic uh, pistol holster that holds my 40. Uh, my Glock 27, my 40 the Smith & Wesson round. Um, I've also got two additional magazines in there. I've got one on the firearm, uh, one on the holster, and then I've got a third one all the way to the far right of the screen, uh, the, little, the shorter of the three magazines that are in that upper holder. Uh, next, I have a Diamondback Tactical uh, 4 uh, double stack magazine holster. Um, this will hold four uh, Glock size magazines or two uh, thinner, uh, like Smith & Wesson magazines that use the single stack magazines. Um, but I, in there right now, I have three Glock 17, uh, 9mm, and then one uh, 40 or Glock 27 40 caliber uh, magazine. Um, down, going down here, I've got these three Condor 25 round uh, Molly holders for shotgun shells. These will hold uh, 12 gauge, 25 rounds. Um, of each, I've got a double op buck, I've got a bird shot, and then I've got a miscellaneous. I've got some uh, incendiary rounds, especially ammo and stuff like that. Um, off to the side here, I have some pull ring smoke, um, which are pretty cool. I've yet to try them, but I've seen some videos of people using them. They look pretty cool. Um, over to this side, I'm debating whether or not I'm going to integrate some more of these, but I do have some 26.5 millimeter round uh, holders, uh, or I'm sorry, rounds, and then I've also got a Diamondback Tactical 4. Uh, 37 or 40 millimeter uh, round holder so it'll hold up to four rounds or you could actually put two 26.5 millimeter rounds in each holder and I've also got a 37 uh, millimeter to 26.5 flare adapter in there uh, so basically I've got six additional rounds of uh, 26.5 flares uh, which are actually smokes in there. Uh, next moving on I've got a set of 511 tactical gloves these are the sure grip gloves I've got an elk ridge uh, bowie knife then I've got, for a right drop leg, I've got my Glock 17 on there, um, along with the magazine in the firearm, and then an additional magazine on there. So I've actually got four Glock 17 magazines on me um, in the standard 17 round. Uh, on my back, I'll have a, uh, this is a Condor, yeah, it's a Condor uh, drop mag pouch, basically just a drop pouch, and you can put several dozen magazines in there. So the nice thing is you don't have to drop them on the ground or leave them around. Um, on the left leg, I have a Black Hawk Tactical Dual Magazine Drop Holder, um, Drop Leg Holder. This thing's pretty cool. Um, it was originally designed for AR-15 mags, but if you double stack Glock mags in there, I've got two 33 round magazines, um, and they slide in really easily, and they just fit actually really nicely in here, and they buckle up. So I'm going to get two more of those magazines, so I'll have an additional four 33 round magazines on top of four. 517 rounds, so I'm going to have close to 200 rounds of mag am ammunition for my 9mm. So if I end up getting my Keltec sub 2000, I'll be able to have a lot of ammunition with me for that, um, as well as my Mossberg 500 um, with the Black Hawk uh, collapsible stock on there. I've got the Surefire M952 tactical light on there, um, and basically just a 500 with a 16 inch uh, security barrel on there, is what they call it. A uh, really great gun to shoot. I love doing skeet shooting with that barrel. Um, but anyways, just kind of give an overview of what all I have here so far. Um, I've also got a couple of things. I've got a pair of black tactical uh, 511 pants, and uh, probably end up getting like a black long sleeve shirt, um, just so I can wear underneath it, so I kind of blend in. Um, anyways, like I said, just kind of give you guys an overview of what I have so far tactically wise uh, for my setup. Tune in, rate, and uh, don't forget to comment. Look forward to hearing from you guys. Thanks.